I think certainly second half performance was good. First half, um, we were a little bit off colour. Um, yeah, we, we created some good shots, but opportunities didn't quite take them, um, which led to the boys getting a little bit frustrated. But you know, we, we spoke about it at half time and, and kind of relaxed a little bit and then um, flipped the switch and, and came away with a good result. As I've said to I've said to some of the guys uh, during the week that a lot of teams are going to come at us early doors. So 40, 50, 60 minutes, we can expect a battle. So I'm sure onlookers and even guys in the team were a bit, um, I suppose, not worried, but probably not as happy that we were in the position we were, rather than maybe a few points ahead or a score or two ahead. So. It's going to be the season like that. It's going to be teams are coming coming after us, and um, we just have to keep keep with our process and grind it out. Yeah, about time. Yeah, I've been getting a bit of stick from my sponsor to um, get his name and their name read out um, here at home. So I'll have to work on that for this week. But yeah, it's good to get over. Um, had a good tough battle with the opposition uh, six, so he kind of probably revved me up a little bit, and I wanted to wanted to score for that reason probably so yeah preparation has been good um, we did some tough work on Monday as usual we do our fitness kind of stuff on Monday so tough blowout on Monday got that kind of long trip out of us and then Tuesdays uh, quite con constructive um, looking over again reviewing the game and seeing what we can work on and then kind of pushing on towards this weekend so yeah really positive loads of energy um, we've touched on already there is a good atmosphere in the camp um, but yeah always striving to get to that next level and push on one step at a time week by week really Look, the forward are always difficult to play um, they approach the game differently to, to other teams uh, they, they'll keep the ball for long periods um, uh, they like to, to, to run the ball a lot and attack from anywhere, um, so they pose a lot of threats, so we'll have to be on the money to, to, to get away with the win. Um, I haven't played Files last season um, and kind of known a little bit about them. They are a good side, they've been in this league for a while now and they've, um, they bring a good style of rugby. Um, they're definitely a side that likes to play, um, likes to get offloads away and kind of um, bring some continuity to their game. So they, yeah, we definitely have to be wary of them. They may not have had the best start, but I don't think in this league um, you can be too complacent with things like that. Um, they could come down here and everything clicks, you know. So it might have just taken them that long. So we're not, we're not underestimating them or any other team, to be honest. Um, but we're looking forward and trying to kind of build on what we've started, I suppose, here this year and kind of the legacy that was made of this home ground last year and push on from there. Uh, we've rotated a few guys up front uh, just to freshen things up. Uh, Dan Pullen just played a lot of minutes already uh, as has Will Norton so, so we, we've swapped those guys in for um, for Luke Chapman and Marcus Street. Um, but apart from that we're, we're pretty much as we were. We picked up a couple of injuries. Uh, Dan Colley is uh, going to be out but um, apart from that I think we're, we're as we were.